I love Golden High School. I do. I really like Golden High School. I think it's pretty cool. I, I think it's like Golden High School, you know? It's a pretty legit school. Way better than Wheat Ridge. It was a good place to go to high school. Uh, good faculty, good students. I had a lot of fun. and I think I came out with a lot. So. Golden, Colorado. A beautiful town with beautiful people and places. One such place is the historic Golden High School. Golden High School was created in 1873, being one of the first in Colorado and the first in Jefferson County. I like Golden. I mean, it's a, it's a, it has a real sense of community here versus I've been a high school that 3,200 kids. Golden High School's attendance has increased over the years. It did not offer graduation until 1886 when only 11 students graduated. In 2011, Golden High School is expecting 300 seniors to graduate. The new one by far. Yeah, yeah. I think things are um, more modern now. Uh, it, working in the old building was it's kind of a dungeon. I, uh, it, I liked it equally as well. <laughs> um, I know the high school was down in the middle of Golden High Yeah. But I never, I was too young. A little baby pee. Throughout its history, Golden High School has moved several times. Its first building was on Cheyenne Street. It later moved to 10th Street in 1924. And finally, it moved over to 24th Street in 1953 due to its increased enrollment. The newest building was constructed in 2008 and is considered state of the art. Bob Hayes has seen Golden High School change over the past few decades. He attended as a student and has taught here for many years. Here from 1964 to 1967. It was uh, three grades, 10, 11, 12, we had about 850 kids. So if you multiply that just the four grades that we have now, it'd be, more, it'd be about uh, 1,100, so maybe 150 less than we have now, so about the same size over the years. Like every school, Golden High School has had its problems. In 1905, Golden High School was saved from a boiler accident by its janitor, Oscar Nolan. I heard that's how Freddy Krueger was made. He was down in the boiler, <laughs> there was the fire, he got scarred, and now he's in my dream. I know that uh, the custodian at the time, because uh, they had to stoke the boilers to keep the, the building, and he had um, checked on it, and he had to have water in the boilers, okay? Um, and he was leaving, and he saw a lot of steam or smoke coming out, so he ran back, and he set off the alarm. Well, he found out that the water had been drained out of the boiler, so it was heating nothing. It was going to heat hot air to cause it to expand and explode. So he rang the bell or did whatever was necessary to evacuate the school and got the boiler turned off. Uh, and as the history goes, what I know about it is they believe that if it had been another few more minutes, the building would have exploded. Golden High School is steeped in history from 1873 up till now. It has always been a great high school filled with great students and great teachers. Golden High School lives on.